I am currently at Olmstead Point. I've got my lake in the background here. And, uh, yep, we're in Yosemite. A lot of tourists, a lot of people. But I'm waiting for fellas to show up. Uh, Matt, Paul, and Matthew. They're uh, supposed to be meeting here at Olmstead Point. Um, we we're trying to get a, a, um, a uh, permit, a wilderness permit for Cloud Rest, which is up that way. And um, unfortunately, we weren't able to get a, a permit for Cloud Rest where I wanted um, for the trailhead. We wanted to. Unfortunately, where we're at, there's only one trailhead um, that's uh, feasible. Uh, the other trailhead would be adding another, I don't know, seven to ten miles. Um, so, uh, then we we're going to try for Mount Hoffman, May Lakes area, and that's booked up too, so. Um, we are going to North Dome. Uh, we got a permit for North Dome overnight. Uh, it's about five miles in, and uh, we're going to camp um, on top or as close to North Dome as we can, preferably on North Dome itself. We should have a beautiful sunset, beautiful uh, stellar moonrise over Half Dome, and then an uh, uh, amazing sunrise tomorrow. I'm looking forward to that. So it's just a quick overnight trip, um, hiking in, spend the night, come out with the, these three guys. So uh, as soon as they get here, we're going to go down to the trailhead and get going. So I shall check in when we start. We are doing it. We're in Yosemite. We got Matt, Will Paul, and Matthew. What's up? And myself, we're going out to North Dome. And uh, right now we're on some kind of a service road down <coughs> to the trail that breaks off. What is that some bear poop down there? Scat! We've seen our first scat. Mine? Mine? What are you talking about? We've seen Matt this whole time. <laughs> and so, uh, we've got four and a half, five miles south to North Dome, and then we're camping out on the dome for the night. So, we'll see. It turns out the weather's beautiful. Clear blue skies, the smoke's cleared out from all the fires. And, uh, Too cold. It's actually just right. The temperature's just right. Unlike what two months ago or a month ago. <laughs> Up at the last place we went, it was super hot. Yeah, so, anyways, we'll uh, check in with an update further further up the trail. All right. We we have uh, we have stopped for a little bit longer than we anticipated. We got about. Of a half a mile or more ahead from this point and then came back we realized that this is our last water source I wasn't able to capture anything <laughs> um, but because uh, we were busy working digging holes and trenches to get running water out of this um, silty swampy area but we will get our 10,000 <laughs> steps in today but we yeah we're getting our 10,000 <laughs> steps in um, Matthew is is uh, together now are you, are you good to go no <laughs> I need food and another break. <laughs> yeah. So well. <laughs> Matthew's been uh, wanting to take breaks every every five minutes. So, uh, but we've been pushing along. But we got we refilled water, uh, so we have water for dinner uh, tonight uh, for some folks, and uh, we're back on our way now to regain regain our steps and um you know those uh the, the even the trek back is counting towards our 10,000 steps so yeah so so we are back on the trail we got about two i think we got about two more than two miles in and then had to backtrack about a half mile because <coughs> um, we realized we passed our last water source so and it's a uh, being said it's the middle of august all the, the small creeks are dried up here 
So, we got about two. You taking a dump? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and, uh, um, we got about two miles to go, I think. So, Matthew is is uh, heading off into uh, the woods the woods to become <laughs> one with nature and uh, Matthew just remember you have to head south to get to North Dome remember when you lean against that tree I'm 100% certain that if Matthew were left in the wilderness alone he would die within 24 hours <laughs> Well, his survival skills do not look good thus far. Well, actually they do because we'll be coming back this way in less than 24 hours. So. <laughs> <laughs> we, but still, we may not see him again. Yeah. So, I don't, I don't know. Should we, should we wait for him? <laughs> Anyways, meanwhile, stay tuned to find out if Matthew makes it back to trail or not. So, we'll catch you later. All right. Thank you. Yeah, we're recording. All right. We are... Uh, at the top of Indian Ridge, we are heading up to Indian Rock to check out this, uh, this view and this um, arch rock formation that we've heard a lot about but never seen. So, we're gonna check it out and then uh, come back and pick up our packs. So, we'll check up here in a little bit. We made it. We made it up to Indian Rock. Indian right. Rock. Matt's up there underneath the arch. And we get up here. And we got a nice, nice view of Half Dome. In the valley there. Oh man. Let's climb up. There we go. Made it up to Indian Rock and check this view out. Half dome through the arch. And just an amazing view. All the way around. Breezy up here, so I don't know how much the GoPro is gonna pick, pick up. Trekking along back there, and the other guys are ahead. So we are getting to our destination. Um, probably gonna look for a place to set up camp and, uh, and then go explore a little bit, have dinner go down and moonrise tonight. It should be pretty awesome. I don't know if I'll be able to capture that on video, but I do have my camera with me, so definitely to get it.
watching the sun go down uh, and that went back to get something from the sun, which is behind us on the way. <coughs> and, uh, but we got this view of Half Dome, watching the sun go down in this Half Dome. Or, uh, well, the sunset's behind us, but we're watching the, the uh, shadows crawl up. The, um, sky still so you can capture the detail of the moon in your pictures. So that's what we're going to try to do and uh, it's, been a, it's been a nice day. Um, took a little bit longer to get started and get going up here than what we really like but uh, overall hiking was pretty easy getting up here. <coughs> we're all pretty tired though. stuff on the GoPro once the moon gets up over half dome if there's enough light so hopefully be able to capture that. All right check it out full moon or near full moon rising over half dome hopefully the GoPro can pick it up check that out beautiful the sun has gone down for good all around us. Matt and I have taken pictures of the last hour of the sun setting, the last lights of half dome in the mountains. We're gonna go, probably go back to camp here in a minute. Uh, get some more warm clothes on and uh, freshen up a bit. Then, once it gets really dark, we might end up walking out back out to uh, up to North Town, taking some night shots of the moonlight of Yosemite Valley and the mountains. So um, I won't be able to capture that on GoPro. Uh, it won't be bright enough to pick it up properly. But uh, there it 
Yes. Morning. We are just waking up about seven. I wouldn't say just waking up. We've probably been in and out of sleep. But uh, I'm just going up over God's rest and spend some time on our uh, campsite here. This is our morning one to do. Getting, getting ourselves together, getting breakfast going. <coughs> and uh, waking up here. After breakfast, we'll pack it up. on out. So, slept all right last night, in and out, um, off and on. Um, it's times where it was like really quiet and forgot where I was at, and other times you'd hear like a pine cone drop or somebody snoring, and uh, I remember that we're out in the wilderness right now, but it's this beautiful morning, and uh, it's like some of the smoke and haze is not burnt off, but drifted away, so it's pretty clear right now, so we're going to finish getting, getting ourselves together and start heading out, so we'll catch you back later. Alright, here we are, hiking, hiking out, that's our view, there's North Dome over there, Half Dome and the surrounding scene right here, it's a beautiful morning. All the smoke cleared out, but we got a clear view of Yosemite Valley and surrounding mountains. It wasn't like this yesterday when we showed up, so it was beautiful. We had an awesome moonrise last night, and afterwards, Matt and I spent about three or four hours on North Dome taking pictures. It was just amazing. So, we're hiking out now. The uh, guys are up here checking out, and uh, we're gonna make it out of here.